שלום אליכם. סימן תף רשע אין חט, זה מאוד מעניין. זה מדבר על בעיות פרפרנס. כשאתה אומרת שיש לך כסף כדי לקנות אחת או שתי דברים, מה הוא עושה? זה מאוד מעניין ללמוד את זה הלכות. ברוך השם, הם לא כל כך רלוונטים היום, אבל הם היו כל כך רלוונטים בדברים רבות בהיסטוריה. אז הגמרא אין שבת כ"ב אומרת שכשאתה אומרת שיש לך כסף כדי לקנות אחת או שתי דברים, או חנוכה קנדלס, או חנוכה קנדלס, יש לך שבת קנדל. למה יש לך כסף כדי לקנות אחת? which means, the Gemara says over there, Shabbat Tov Gimel, that when a person bumps into the wall, he does no Shalom Bait. And therefore, it's better on Shabbat Chanukah that he has enough money to buy the candle, one candle, he should buy it for Shabbat, because Shabbat comes to light up the house, so a person should have Shalom Bait. Unlike the Chanukah candle, Chanukah candle you put outside your house, and you're not benefiting from its light. says the Mishnah Bura that some poskim hold that today since you put the Hanukkah candle in your house so therefore you do have light on in the house and therefore you should light the candle for Hanukkah and not for Shabbat although the halacha is that you're not allowed to benefit from the candle light of Hanukkah candle light but still over here it says it's just like Sh'at HaSakana and therefore it would be permitted Many poskim say that even more so today that there's electricity light, so therefore Shabbat is taken care of by the electricity, you're not going to bump in, into the walls, and therefore you should light that candles for Hanukkah and not for Shabbat. Continues the Shulchan Aruch and says, if you have enough to buy the candle for Shabbat, but you don't have enough to buy for Hanukkah, and wine, but rather for one of them, either Hanukkah or for wine for Kiddush. What should you buy? Says the Shulchan Aruch, that you can learn from Hanukkah because Pirsuma Nisa. Pirsuma Nes is more important, therefore you should buy the candle for Hanukkah and do the Kiddush on bread. Also, if a person doesn't have enough to buy for Ner Hanukkah and wine for Havdalah, he should buy for Ner Hanukkah and not for the Havdalah. Yen hav, the, the wine for Havdalah is not as important as the Ner Hanukkah because Ner Hanukkah is Pirsuma Nisa. Says the Mishnah Bura, when we spoke about lighting a candle for Shabbat in order to light up the house, how many candles are we talking about? One, not two. Normally it's very important to, write, to light two candles for Shabbat, Keneg, Zachor, Veshamor, but over here one would be sufficient and the rest you should light for Hanukkah. And even if it is not the first night of Hanukkah, but let's say it's the sixth night of Hanukkah and it's Shabbat, how many candles should you light? Light one for Shabbat and the rest light for Hanukkah because you have enough sufficient to buy seven candles. So one candle for Shabbat, six candles for Hanukkah. It's more important to light the candles once you have a Shabbat candle lighting the house. It's more important to light those candles for the Hidur Mitzvah of Hanukkah.